At St. Paul's, we have been shining the light of love and hope in this community for generations. And this year, shining that light feels as important as ever. I want to invite you to join us in shining your light as you share your gifts. Our world is in a state of crisis. We have discovered over the last several months just how divided we can be, and at the same time, we have learned how important the human connection that holds us together is. We believe that love is what matters, and everything we do at St. Paul's is about celebrating and exploring God's love for us and for the whole world. Even when we are apart, think of all the ways that you can be a part of what St. Paul's is doing to shine the light of love and hope in this community. Think of the formation opportunities as we shape the lives of God's children of all ages, forming them in ways that lead them to see what God's dream for this world is. Think about the outreach programs that we offer, those that meet the needs that present themselves to us immediately, needs of our siblings in our neighborhoods and in our community, needs that we are called to respond to right now. Think also of the ways that St. Paul's advocates for justice in order that the ways in which our economy and our community do not provide a fair share for all people, do not respect the dignity of every human being, think of the ways that we work to change this society into the vision that God dreams it could be. That is the work that we do. And when you give to St. Paul's, you give not only to support those ministries, but to give your heart and to give yourself to that important work. Over the next few weeks, I invite you to take time to think about all the blessings that God will give you in 2021, and then pray and ask God what part of those gifts you will devote to that work in this church and in the world around us. Stewardship is not measured in how much you give, it's measured in how much of your heart that you give. Some of us have experienced loss greater than we expected. Others of us have discovered that we're safer from hardship than we thought we might be. Whatever your circumstance, you have an opportunity to share your life and to shine your light with those who need to see that light most. Over the coming weeks, you'll hear more from parishioners who are experiencing the ways in which our church is shining the light of hope in this community, not only with the members of this parish, but with others beyond our walls. And you'll also hear opportunities for you to make your own commitment to our annual giving campaign. I hope that by October the 18th, we'll be able to bring our commitments together in person with an outdoor worship service. But I also recognize that some of us, even then, will not be able to gather. Regardless, do know that you are a part of this community, a part of this church that believes that love is what we need more than anything. Always remember that no matter how far we might feel apart from one another, we are united together. Together, we are one family, one family of God, committed to God's love, and through that, we are a light to those who need to see it most. God bless you.